EView 7 introduced integration between EViews and both R and MATLAB. This integration allowed seamless passing of data between those applications in EViews and the ability to run code or snippets from MATLAB or R from within EViews. This integration is an incredibly powerful tool allowing users to mix the natural graphical interface of eViews alongside its formidable data handling routines with the powerful matrix and statistical programming languages of MATLAB or R. It also provides an easy way for non-programmers to access any of the myriad of econometric techniques written in R or MATLAB without facing the steep learning curves associated with those packages. In the seven years since we released eView7, R has become an even greater tool in the econometrician's toolbox and so we thought it was time to revisit our integration and see if we can improve things a little. Consequently, we've made a few changes. eViews no longer relies on a third-party product to provide the connectivity to R. There are new XON and XOFF commands, allowing you to send multiple commands to R easily. A more interactive R command window. The ability to save and open R data workspace files. A new X package command to easily download and load R packages, and an XVernum command to return the version of R being used. I'm going to demonstrate some of these new features and show how easy it is to use eViews alongside R. To begin, I'm going to check that my eViews R environment is set up correctly. I'm going to click on Options, General Options, and navigate to the External Program Interface node. Here I will ensure that the comprog ID is the new built-in version, which is termed eviewsrcon.variantrcon. I'm also going to check which installation of R eViews is going to interact with. In my case, I'm going to be using my R 3.4.0 installation, but I could change it to any of the other installations I have. Having made sure everything is set up properly, it's time to open a connection to R. We do this by using the xopen command with an R option. Once the connection is open, eViews displays a log window showing our connectivity to R. I can use this window to issue commands to R directly. Here I'm creating a set of random numbers and then displaying a plot of them. More excitingly, if I have an eViews work file open, I can send the data from that work file over to R to use R functions with the data. In this work file I have some monthly electricity demand data and I'm going to send over the elect demand series to R using the xput command. Now that it is in R, I can use R commands on it such as printing a summary of the data or displaying a histogram. If I create new data in R, say by creating a standardized version of the electricity demand, we can then bring those data back into eViews as a series using the xget command. Often, you'll want to use one of the many packages available for R rather than the default functions. This can be done using the standard R commands. Here I'm going to use R's excellent forecast package to forecast my demand series using an automatically chosen method. Then I'll retrieve those forecasts back into eViews. Of course, you can also use this interoperability with R inside an eViews program. I have here a quick program that calls the gets R package, which uses the general to specific modeling to select the appropriate regressors and indicate the saturation terms for an equation. The gets package requires R 3.3 or higher, so I'm using the xvernum command to ensure that I have a recent enough version of R installed. Note I'm also using the handy x package command which tells R to install a package if it is not already installed and then load it. We then use x put to send our data over to R, x run to tell R to run the package, and then we use x on and x off between some R code that passes the results from the gets package. And then finally we fetch the results back using the x get 
and produce an EV's equation with the selected model. Then we close the connection to R. Running this program, you can see it provides a seamless interface to R. Someone running this program in eViews would not need to know any R programming at all to utilize the GETS package. Of course, it's possible to take this further and create an eViews program that adds a complete interface to an R package using eViews' interface commands, and even package that program as an eViews add-in. For example, I can run this add-in that calls the same GETS package in R.